Now, let's go over controlling your profile settings in Skype. You click the Skype tab, go down to Preferences, click that. So you can click the General tab, and you can go down. You can click if you'd like to check for updates automatically, show your status in the menu bar. You can even set your iTunes song as your mood message. You can clear your recent conversations when you sign out. You could also set where you'd like your downloads to go. You can also change your privacy settings. You can go to show my picture to whomever you like, allow calls. You can basically set it so that certain people can get in and certain people can't. Then you can go over to the calls tab. And when you get incoming calls, you can either answer it automatically, do nothing, or forward the calls to your cellular device. You can go over to your messaging tab to also personalize that. You can let people see your Skype name or your mobile number. Then you can head over to notifications. When you sign into your Skype, it can play a certain sound if you like. Then you can go over to your audio and video. You can check to make sure your camera is working properly. Yeah, I think it's working just fine. Head over to the Advanced tab for the Advanced Skype users who can use Skype access to connect to Wi-Fi hotspots or display any technical information you need. So that's how you can control your account settings and your privacy settings on Skype.